Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm bringing you a video that I don't think anybody has requested, but I really wanted to make. This is my Living Dead Girl lipstick video. Basically, I love the color gray. I love gray eyeshadow. I love gray lipstick. I love gray tones. So I wanted to make a video all about those sort of gray lip colors. There are four lip pencils that I recommend if you like to wear these sort of colors. Although, unfortunately, I found out two of them were discontinued. The two that are discontinued are ColourPop Marshmallow and ColourPop Petty Four. I don't know why ColourPop discontinued them when they kept both of the Ultra Satin lipsticks that are those colors. The two other lip pencil alternatives are OCC Sebastian and one that I don't own, but looks like it would be a good match, which is Bite Beauty Lip Pencil in 12, which is like a plum taupe. So I'm gonna be doing lip swatches of all of these lipsticks for you. The first color is Kat Von D Zero, which is a Dove Gray. Super beautiful, so glad I finally caved and bought this. Next we have Urban Decay Oblivion, and Oblivion is a cool toned taupe. Then we have Fairy Girl Luna. This is a cool gray. This is ColourPop Marshmallow. It's a gray lavender. I love this color. This is Lunatic Cosmetic Labs Bruja. This is probably the color that started my Living Dead Girl lip obsession. It's a pinky taupe, like a pinky mauve taupe. This is Bite Beauty Thistle. It's a mauve infused taupe, mauve infused taupe, however you want to say it. This is Makeup Geek Misfit. It's a deep gray with purple undertones. It's probably the deepest color in this set. OCC Sebastian, metallic cool taupe with silver pearl. This is Sugar Pill Kimchi, matte lavender mauve with a subtle, unique blend of transparent aqua and violet sparkle. This is probably the lightest and my favorite out of all of these. Notoriously Morbid Dagon. This is like a dusty pink taupe with a blue sheen and the blue sheen like duochrome is very strong. This is NYX Smoke Me. It's a pastel lilac gray. This is Bite Beauty Gelato. It's a hazy plum with taupe tones. I rarely wear this on the lips. I almost exclusively use it on my cheeks. Now, as I mentioned, I really love these colors. That, and the reason I love it is because I really enjoy the whole living dead girl look. I really like the pale gray lips with like deep, intense eyes. Especially if like, you know, you have your graphic eyes going on like I do right now. So my favorite long wearing one out of all of these is the Sugar Pill Kimchi because it does wear for a very long time and it's very, very comfortable to wear. It's a great liquid lipstick formula. I just got Kat Von D Zero, but I'm quite fond of it. I feel like this lipstick formula is different from the other lipstick formulas I own from Kat Von D. So I really like the color and I like how it feels on my lips. Urban Decay's Oblivion is pretty much like a My Lips But Better type version of this color, and I consider it like an easy go-to nudish lip. Makeup Geek Misfit is really nice when I want a deeper, more intense version of this lip. So anyway, what do you think of the whole Living Dead Girl lipstick? Please be sure to let me know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful or informative, please give it a thumbs up and share. Thanks so much for watching.